Hi everyone, Lisa Haven here, and I've got a huge report to share with you. Everything from a kind of unusual but bold statement by Kim.com. Love him or hate him, he's got some pretty shocking things. He's a political advocate, entrepreneur, as many of you know, uh, got in trouble somewhat with the government there. But not just that, I kind of also want to take what he has to say and also focus it on what's going on in the economy. Now, many of you are aware that the economy is doing good. And as I've stated in an earlier report, we've got some parallels uh, in the stock market that is to 2000 and today. So I wanted to bring on a specialist and ask the question, are we headed uh, for some type of correction? So I brought on Colin Plume with noblegoldinvestments.com. Colin, are you with me over there? I'm, I'm here, Lisa. Thank you. And uh, yeah, I, I, Kim.com is an interesting story. A lot of people probably saw the documentary about him and he was a internet entrepreneur and created websites with unbelievable traffic millions and millions and millions of hits a day and got in trouble because he was sort of off the grid so to speak like a lot of people that make a lot of money they they want to be able to have that freedom to to travel and and he had businesses in many different countries and so he's an interesting character and he's always believed uh, in in trying to be ahead of the curve whether it's the internet or money or finance and so i think you know, he's come out with some pretty bold statements in terms of what he thinks is going to happen with the U.S. dollar. Well, let me actually, I'm going to toss up uh, what he said out on Twitter the other day, and it was sent out August 12th, 2018. Here's what it says. Trust me, buy crypto and gold. Your U.S. dollar will become worthless. With U.S. economic collapse, all old money currencies will crash. Times will get tough, but you'll be fine if you hedge some of your assets in preparation for the crash. The big crash is coming 100%. Uh, now, that that's bold to say with 100% certainty a crash is coming. And he specifically you know, references that to the U.S. US dollar, which again, it's statements like this, you know, whether or not you agree with him, hate him, love him, whatever the case may be, obviously he, he earns a lot, he's, he, you know, of money, but here's the thing, um, this is why, again, I encourage everybody to get involved in other assets like, you know, like your Trump coin, <laughs> which I'll have you talk about, and your gold and silver, because people like him and, and other people who uh, are really in the economy are saying things like that. So, Well, and, and you look at gold, it's funny because you see um, a lot of bull investors just keep diving more money in the stock market. And it, it's probably hard for a lot of investors to look at gold or silver or crypto and say, hey, I want to invest there. Gold is at a 17-month low, uh, just below 1,200 today. It's the lowest it's been in, you know, like I said, almost two years. Uh, Ethereum, one of the major cryptocurrencies, is in the mid-300s, the lowest it's been in over six months. Uh, Bitcoin is down. So all these things are down, uh, which for a lot of investors, they say, well, is it going to continue to go down? Is it the time to invest? Um, but I think smart money investors typically will buy if they see a correction like this they see an opportunity um, we a lot of money will move into cryptos as it's going up you'll see Bitcoin go back up to 10 and 12 and 14 thousand and people will wait to buy uh, but I think the opportunities in, in metals and these alternative assets are, are right now and I think a lot of it has to do with the debt the debt is is it's that anchor that's always going to hold us back in terms of the economy as much as great as everything is when you have this unbelievable debt, the government has to continue to print money. We have to devalue our currency to cover that debt. It doesn't work any other way. So the value of our dollar, our paper dollar, is dropping every day. And that's something that people need to factor into their investments. So here's a question I have for you then. Is it right for me to say now is the time to get your gold, to get your Trump coins, your silver, and invest in that cryptocurrency when the market is good? Because when the market flips or up or downturns, that's when a lot of these things are going to go up, correct? Yeah, 2008 is a perfect example. Uh, 2008 gold dropped a little bit uh, initially when the, we had the correction, and then gold went up 20% per year. 
from 2008 till 2011. Silver went up more and went on a historic run. So yeah, I mean, these things are definitely going to move up uh, over time. Just in terms of the downside, risk is really low because you look at just to mine gold, they say to mine gold is anywhere from a thousand to eleven $1 hundred dollars. Uh, silver is most people say to mine silver is in the high teens, so we're basically at or below mining costs. And then just in terms of cryptos, you're looking at you know Bitcoin and Ethereum. You know these these cryptocurrencies are just starting to come out in the public. People are just starting to buy them. Less than one percent of Americans even own any cryptocurrency. So. All of these things are still really low, still kind of coming out in the forefront. And if you're looking to diversify and get some money out of the stock market, if you're nervous about something, I think taking a portion and, and looking at these other assets is really good. And you know, you just don't want to have all your eggs in one basket, Lisa. That's that's what we talk about. You want to have different investments because you never know what's going to happen. True. And that's why I bring people like you on. So I know this is brand new and I've been advertising Trump Coin 2020. I loved what you guys did to the back, put the accomplishments. So yeah. what, uh, tell us a little bit, just briefly uh, about your Trump Coin 2020. And of course, uh, if for everybody out there that wants one of these, it is five dollars off with the code Lisa. So absolutely, yeah. Just make sure to put the code in when they when they purchase. Put your name in there. It's real easy. Um, you know, I think people are loving the coin. A lot of people are giving them as gifts. Um, that's been really common. A lot of people are giving them to grandkids. Some people are just holding them on. I, I've talked to a lot of you know investors that buy coins. Typically, when you look at it, a presidential coin, a coin that's going to be a commemorative coin over time to get it you know with the discount to get it for $30 is, is basically a bargain um, it's real silver and people will look around and say oh there's all these other coins but a lot of them 99% of them are uh, silver plated uh, I've seen some some gold plated coins that people that it's confusing the way they advertise it. they'll put 24 karat but there's no gold in it this is real silver so a silver rises as we just talked about, the price is low. As silver rises, the value of this coin is going to go up. So I, I think it's going to be someone that is finally fed up and wants to get that piece of, you know, get something with Trump on it to give to a friend or to hold on to. Because a lot of what we're finding interesting enough, a lot of people in California are buying them. And I think people think, oh, there's no Republicans here. There's not Trump supporters. I would say in terms of the states, California is in the top two or three in terms of purchase. Um, so there are a lot of people all over the country that are supporting Trump. Maybe they're doing it privately, but I think this gives people a chance to say, yeah, I support him. I want to get a piece. I want to get some silver. And, and I think people are really excited when they receive it. Yeah, absolutely. That's hope for California, right? <laughs> like absolutely. It is. And we and California needs it. Yeah, definitely. So tell me, um, and I know you guys also do Roth IRAs and convert those into gold and silver. So check that out below at noblegoldinvestments.com too. But back to kind of the economy um, in, in kind of a conclusion, do you see a correction coming? If so, what kind of correction or what would it look like, I guess? Yeah. You know, I, I think the good thing about the economy is I don't think we'll see the correction that we saw in 2008 for a number of reasons. Uh, we haven't seen, you know, just in terms of debt mortgages wise, you know, you're not seeing as much of that no money down scenario. I know there's some some small programs out there where people can buy a house with no money down, but generally speaking, it's 10 percent, 15, 20 percent. That's all. Those are all good things, and I think that will. Uh, lessen the blow when we have the correction because if someone's putting 20% down, uh, they're going to be less likely to walk away from a house, even if the market turns around. Whereas in 2008, a lot of people just didn't have any equity. They didn't have any money in it and they just figured, wow, I'll just, I'll just walk away. Um, and so, you know, those are things that I think will make it the soften the blow. Um, but I mean, we're at a, the Dow and the NASDAQ are at astronomical numbers. So I, I think you have to think, hey, I'm going to take a little profit off the table, move it into some other assets. Um, and I can tell you, we always talk about it. If, if, if I was to give you $100,000 today, most people would not put all that money in the stock market. Yet, a lot of people have the majority of their net worth in the stock market and they don't think that they can do anything. And I just, we always talk about, look at what other things are out there. I mean, listen, if, if CDs and treasury bonds get to five, six percent, you know, that's a great investment to be in. You know, if they're now they're paying two, you know, two and a half, 
But I just think you have to look at the whole pie of your retirement and make sure that you're protected. And that's, you know, diversification is what we talk about. All of our guides are free, our gold guide, our Bitcoin, silver, all the information's free. So if nothing else, people just want to get educated about what we do. We're, we're happy to offer that. And, and it's no pressure. Everyone will find. I think you know this when people call in. It's a friendly environment. We want to get people good information. And I think they're happy once they do it. Well, yeah. Well, I'm so excited uh, that you got to come on and share a lot of that because I I really feel it's important for you guys, the listener, and, and this is straight from my heart to you. I'm a very big diverse, you know, I'm, I diversify myself. I've got cryptos, I've got gold, I've got silver. Now I've got my Trump coin and many other things. And, and I say Trump coin a lot just because I freaking love it. That's like, <laughs> like what I do. And I'm buying it for a ton of friends. But not only that, but, you know, converting your 401ks when you're thinking lifelong, that's huge. And when people like Kim.com, and he's not been the only one that come out and make these 100 uh, percent statements, it kind of, you know, it's 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 something that we really got to think about. And when you take the economy in a nutshell and look at it, we can't continue with trillions and trillions and trillions of dollars in debt. Something's got to happen. Yeah, the economy's doing good, but at some point, uh, it's going to go down. But now is the time to start diversifying, not when the market goes south. That's when you kind of don't want to buy. <laughs> so right. Now is the time to get yeah. into the gold and the silver and the cryptocurrencies. I might shy away from stocks right now, uh, but those gold, silver and cryptocurrencies are, I think, a little more valued with that. Agreed? Absolutely. Absolutely. And I, and I think, you know, one thing, Lisa, that you always talk about is just people for, for people to get educated. I think that's what your channel does is you really bring to light a lot of things. Maybe articles are not reading. You know, some people wouldn't listen to this Kim.com, even though the guy's a, you know, worth, you know, I think a hundred million dollars and he really has no stake in the game to tell people to invest in these other assets. It's just, it's just what he believes. I think, going alternative and looking at your different options out there and keeping your ear to the rail, so to speak, and, and seeing what's out there is important. That's why, you know, we love your show. That's why we listen to it is is the is the information is good and it's unbiased, which is which is great. And that's that's why we always support your show. Awesome. Well, thank you. And and thanks again for coming on last minute for me. And if you guys want to check out the information below, I have all the links below. Remember, TrumpCoin2020, use code LISA to get that $5 off. Also, noblegoldinvestments.com to check out converting it to a 401k. And the number, uh, the phone number is down there as well. So with that, thank you guys again for tuning into the broadcast. I'm Lisa Haven, and that was Colin Plume signing out.